Hi, this is Rich Coles from Product of Project Solutions. Here's a quick video to show you how you can change the auto numbering column to be what you want it to be. So what I mean by this is if you, for example, have items in this list and you can see it's set an auto number. If I cancel this and add in a new item here, which is going to be Foxtrot, Foxtrot, and then put in the various information and fill out the project, then it comes up with a number in the sequence. And I'm going, well, that's not the next site number I wanted. And if I go to golf, for example, and save that, that's nine. And I'm going, well, you're missing seven and we need to be in sequence. So what I'm gonna do in this case is I'm just gonna double click on here and clearly obviously I could delete these items out, but if I do, they will still just keep rolling up in the next number. So I'm just going to turn off auto number for a moment, turn to text, and now it's text. I can actually just copy this down here and it's in the right sequence again. So five, six, seven, eight. And in this case now, what I can do is just turn it back to being auto number, okay? And on this, I've had to put in PPS on the hyphen um, and put in the numerical places. And the next number in sequence I want is number nine. So I press okay and save. And it should be now that hotel, if I add that this one in, should come up and hey presto, nine comes up. So again, if you ever find your numbers out of line, you can make a change there. And again, if you ever wanted to, for example, change your list and add something in that was different. So for example, on the top row, you didn't want this because it's a demo. So you just want to have X in there, for example, um, and then you want to adjust these. So this is kind of in a different sequence and again, you can do that as well. You save that information in, and then all you need to do is go back in and turn this back into your auto number column. PPS, remember what number you've chosen, zero, zero, zero. Um, and I think the next number was eight or nine. Um, you've got to put the hyphen in here and starting number is gonna be nine, let's just say. So starting number eight, nine, and save. And so then off you go, and then you can carry on the list on that basis. So again, if you want to make tweaks, this is the way to do it. You can adjust it and off you go. So hope that's been useful. Thanks for watching. This is Rich Coles from Productive Project Solutions. Bye for now.